Hello everyone, Mike here. Welcome to this video where I'm going to turn this colonial door frame into this that you would more likely see in a Victorian mansion. All right guys, so yeah, I've, I'm changing this door frame today. So I've been into work this morning and I've machined up a few things. So I've made all of the architraves, so I'll be replacing all that. 
I've made the top blocks, I've made the mid blocks, I'm not sure what you call them, um, so they'll sit around about here, and the Ave blocks. So um, I'm going to be ripping all this out, ripping all that stuff off, and putting the new stuff in and then wood graining it today. So uh, that's what's So that's what you're in store for today. So I'll take the door off and I'll start removing all this architrave.
I should just say, you may, may have seen it, uh, I've drawn out a design for some wainscoting panelling on the wall there. I'll just turn the camera around and I'll explain to you what I'm thinking. All right, so uh, these panels here, four panels, are going to be raised panel and that those panels will continue like that around and down the hallway. So I'm going to put uh, a beading around here, then there'll be a raised panel in the middle and then I'm going to wood grain all of this and then of course there'll be a rail, a chair rail across the top there. So uh, I think, uh, oh, I should mention, there's a new colour, so uh, it's, oh, I forget the name of it, it doesn't really matter, um, pale green, uh, which is kind of like, a, it, it, it's, it's showing it fairly true on the camera, uh, but it's kind of like a pale uh, olive green, I would say. Um, I think with the woodwork, that looks quite nice, and it's not too dark, I know some people have said that uh, maybe the colours I'd chosen before are too dark. Well, this one definitely isn't a dark colour, so, but it's not too light. I don't want it too light. So anyway, that's that little part I thought I might just mention to you. So thanks for watching this video, guys. I do apologise that, you know, it's thrown together a little bit quick. Um, I just, I've been trying to do it for the last, I've been off for a week and uh, I don't feel any better today than I felt a week ago. So it's it's taking a bit of time to, to get over this COVID, which at the, at the, when, it, for when I first started getting sick, I was like, oh damn it, I've got the flu. And um, I actually, uh, Julie had to call an ambulance and I was taken to hospital because I actually fainted. I, I felt sick and um, I went and got a bucket to vomit into and uh, I put it on the table and that's the last thing I remember. I passed out and I ended up on the ground and uh, Julie came running and yeah, off to hospital I went and um, yeah, they tested me and said, oh, you've got COVID. So had all the, uh, they had all the Hascam suits on at the hospital and I was isolated there. It felt like I was in jail. But I was okay. Uh, they, they think that I was dehydrated. I don't know about being dehydrated. I think I just felt really sick and and it uh, I got a bit overwhelmed by by that feeling. I think. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm all good. I've been resting up this week and uh, hopefully I can go back to work Monday. So we'll see how that goes. But I hope you enjoyed seeing this little part come together. It's it's um, a big transformation for this house actually, a little thing like this, but already just looking at the door, uh, it's changed the whole feel of the house and I can't wait to, I'm really working hard now to get the hallway done and the next video you'll see all the progress that I've done in uh, cornice work and flushing and more plasterboard work and uh, uh, did I say flooring? Flooring as well. Um, so yeah, uh, tune in for that next video because uh, that you'll see some uh, sting things starting to get finished off. So yeah, I do apologise that it's a bit slapped together, but uh, I have done my best with the current state of my head. And um, yeah, if you want to leave a comment, tell me what you think about the. Uh, the wood graining and the, uh, the Victorian door um, and also the colour and the you know we've got the colour and we've got the Wayne Scotting idea so if you want to comment about any of that stuff that'd be great and uh, until the next video uh, thanks again very much I very much appreciate all your support and uh, the uh, comments and the likes and all that that you you give me um, so yeah thanks I can't say thank you enough and um, look forward to getting this next video up to you to you up for you to look at pretty quickly and uh, probably by tomorrow and uh, yeah so keep an eye out for that so until then you take care and uh, I'll see you soon cheers <laughs>